So you want to think that there's artificial intelligence inside Modern Warfare 3. But I got something to tell you. But before I do, first take a look at my KD, and it'll pretty much give you an explanation of why as I say this. Yeah, <laughs> boy. Now what you're seeing on the screen is my win-loss ratio and my kill-death ratio. You can see that's a 0 0.28 and a 0 0.19. You broke the rules! You broke the rules! That's right, KD 0 0.28, win-loss ratio is 0 0.19. My deaths and my kills are all right there. You can see everything and you can see my screen in the background glitching. Now, hold on. I think this has something to do with it. Am I 100% definitive on this? I honestly can't sit there and say. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! So what you're seeing in the background is, I have a, what is that? R. Renetti? Yeah, that's what it's, Renetti. Whatever it's called. Yeah, I don't know. But anyways, the Renetti, right? It's fully unlocked. Everything's maxed out. But do you notice anything? Yeah. Uh, I don't have no attachments. There's no attachments there. Hold on, let me click over to something else. Hurry up already, huh? Okay, here's another gun that's fully unlocked. As you can see, glitch again. In fact, this glitch is for every single Modern Warfare 3 gun. I don't know what's going on, but again, this has something to do with the story of what's going on. Uh-huh. If possibly you don't think that's enough, let me go to Modern Warfare 2 guns where they're pretty much all unlocked. And you can see the glitch still is there. See? It's there. Everything I got is the same thing that happened with the, all the attachments. The reason why I tell you all this is because as I live stream, I play with other people. Other people that I play with are all people from my channel. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. So yeah, no, seriously. The reason why I bring this up is because I play with subscribers every single day, just about. And sometimes I get the glitch where when they join, it doesn't actually say their name. It says someone else's name. This is proven time and time again inside my streams. Mainly when I was playing Modern Warfare 2, it has happened actually in this Modern Warfare 3. So, with that being said, there is a guy running around that Nero Cinnamon made a video about. It's over on Reddit. I understand. It's called Demon Juice is his name, I believe. What? As the story goes, what he said was that this guy went around killing like, I believe, four people. And then, as the match was going to end, he disappeared. He didn't show up. The problem with speculations like this is you can never actually formally prove anything. But, actually, I can't. The thing is, is when I reverse boost, it actually kicks me even though I'm dying and still running around playing the game. This is actually a fact. With that being said, I actually proved this point in my video of reverse boosting made easy. You what? With that being said, you can die anywhere from around 140 somewhat to around 180 times before the game actually kicks you. Why, the reason why I say this is because there actually has been times where I go through and actually kill people, but still manage to get kicked if I still continue to kill myself. So, with that being said, if a bot is actually in the lobby, let's say he got the kills all in the beginning of the game. As time passes on the game, he doesn't get no kills, therefore, he will actually in fact get kicked. That doesn't include other things like disconnection issues and all sorts of plethora issues that we've been having in this game. Obviously, I've been actually having the disconnection issue continuously, and again, this can be proven in my streams. I'm just gonna hurt you really, really bad. Guys are so hungry, no way. That's the kind of thing you do. <laughs> Wait, what is this guy doing, bro? What? Oh my gosh, bro. This guy's just bad at the game, bro. Come on now. Come on now. Look at this guy. Look, he's right here. He's right here. He's just bad at the game. As you can see, oh, I actually run into these players all too commonly. A lot of these players, sometimes they even speak to me. Sometimes these players are actually just little kids that run around and don't know exactly what they're doing. These kids do actually play the game. Now, I don't want to negate the fact that with all the evidence that everybody's putting out, I understand, but these bots do exist in the game and I actually run into them almost every single match. 
a lot of people ask me how I get these lobbies. Obviously, I, I just reverse boost. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. But let me also point out that I actually read a lot of the patented. In the patented, on a particular part, which I actually, again, read, that does talk about AI bots. But these bots, from what it sounded like, were bots that were a part of some sort of you playing the game mode. Technically, it sounded more like DMZ. Get a load of this. So with a lot of these players that I encounter inside of Ground War, as well as game modes like Team Deathmatch, Killed, Confirmed, or even Domination, I run into this stuff all too commonly. I like to troll. All my streams just about are me of actually trolling other people because I feel like a douche a little bit because I actually, well, you know, reverse boost. So in fact, what I do more likely is just troll people. I like going in, running circles around them, and they actually do shoot at me. And at times there are people where I think they're bots because I call them bots. And I found out that some of them have mics and talk to me. Reveals that he's being a lying liar who lies No, seriously. I just hate to say this because I've seen so many videos about these bots. But a lot of people have not encountered the lobbies that I have. And I've countered many. So with that being said, take it with a grain of salt. Don't forget to subscribe and give it away a, a PlayStation 5 or an Xbox. Whatever your choice may be. At 25,000 subs, don't forget to hit the like. And I do appreciate anybody that watched this far because, dang, you know what? You're a freaking legend.